Reaction from our local lawmakers have been pouring in since the president's announcement. Governor J.B. Prisker said in part, quote, President Joe Biden has dedicated his life in service to this nation and its citizens are all the better for it. This is a story political career culminating in one of the most accomplished and effective presidencies of our lifetime. As president of the United States, he led us through a recovery from a devastating pandemic and shepherded our economy away from a recession to prosperity. Democratic Senator Tammy Duckworth says in part, no one has done more for working Americans than Joe Biden. And so many of us owe him a debt of gratitude for everything he's done to improve our country. She later added, quote, from the bottom of my heart, I thank him for his effective and successful leadership and for once again putting our country before himself. This difficult decision ensures that Democrats can focus on the goal that unifies each and every one of us, defeating Donald Trump and preventing another four years of his destructive chaos and corruption, end quote. Senator Dick Durbin said on Twitter, formerly on X, formerly known as Twitter, quote, throughout his public career, Joe Biden always put his country first. His four years as president made it clear that he was determined to put our country back on track and restore the soul of our nation. America will be forever grateful for all he has given to this country. And on the Republican side, Congressman Darren LaHood said, quote, for the past four years, the American people have faced record high inflation, a border crisis impacting every community, and the effects of weak leadership on the global stage. It's been clear that President Biden cannot serve four more years, but serious concerns remain about whether he can fulfill his duty over the next four months. No matter who the Democrat Party installs in Chicago next month, Americans are not buying the open border, soft on crime, and out-of-touch policies they are selling, end quote. 